I'm trying to ask you no like gotcha questions, but the one thing I always do want to ask you is when I met Khan, he said when you were locked up, you knew everything was going to happen and you set it down to a T. Excuse me, I'm sorry. How'd you know? For real, for real, like, maybe, 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 maybe. Yeah, the first one. Like I said, I, I always tell people all the time, I can't even explain this shit. Like, I already know yeah. everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a one-on-one -on -one type of bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody ever right. saying something like this ever. You know what I'm saying? So, I can't really, like, say how I knew I could do this shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I've always been real. I've always been fly. Shit. You know what I mean? I, that's how it started. It's just like, you know, when Conway ever got shot, it was just like, yo, nah, our story really than everybody. You know what I'm saying? We, we already lived in rapper's life, so that's easy. You know what I'm saying? The resume check out A1, that's easy. Other other niggas got that. The resume, you know what I'm saying? Flaws on it. They just got fly. I always been fly. I've been fucking fly, so that's all I know, so I was just like, yo. Loud, no moment in your life, it was always because yeah. I always was a leader, I always was a boss, I always thought like that. You know what I'm saying? I, I never had, I never in my life had like I always been the boss, you know what I'm saying? I always been the leader, so I ain't, I ain't never had no big homies. I was the big homie. When were you know fly guy? I mean, the fly guy transition came like. I don't know what was that. Like right when the album came out, like right before. That's when the shit just was just like came about to fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? Like I started having that mentality. I always had that mentality, but like I started doing it like more in the music. You know what I'm saying? You know, just fly guy, man. You know what I'm when was the Pooty said that shit, and it was a rap. Pooty been saying that shit. Pooty was the first one to say. I mean, for real, for besides me, yeah. Yeah, that's why she said that shit. She was two years old. She nine. That was seven years ago. So, you know what I'm saying? Every since Pooty made that drop, it just stuck. You know what I'm saying? It's been five guys ever since. That's a baby. You know what I'm saying? When was the moment, though, that you took yourself seriously as a, as a rapper? As or just period? Guy. Shit, this is day one. Like, you got to understand. This is what I'm trying to tell you. Like, I always had the mentality that can't nobody fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's not something new. That's what I'm saying. I, I've never in my life ever looked at somebody like, yo, you know what I'm saying? In school, I was that nigga. You know what I'm saying? The streets, I was that nigga. When I was a kid, I was that nigga. Now I'm grown. It just travel. You know, it just, as I grew, you know what I'm saying? I love wrestling. I'm front row now. I go love basketball. I sit front door courtside now. I'm, you know what I'm saying? It's just shit. I just enhanced this shit. But it always been. I always had the chains. I always was fly. I always had the baddest bitches. I was driving 2000s 2000. You know what I'm saying? So that's well, what, what made saying. you stick with the art then? I've been doing that since nine years old. And that's another thing. That's what I'm saying. You got a lot of rappers that just got fly in the last year or two. You got everybody clothing designers now in the last year. Two years or after they out, second, third album, now they doing clothes, they doing this and doing that. Bro, I've been doing that shit since nine, ten. It's all about the comic book shit. You know what I'm saying? So that's all it is. What man. about the comic book shit? Ain't no comic book. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't let him <laughs> fuck your questions up. <laughs> what was the first? All right, what was the first piece of art you saw? Yeah, it's that I saw. You saw. That I saw. Yeah. First piece of art you remember? Man, I don't even know, bro. I, you gotta think, man. Like, even as kids, just going to the Albright, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, my shit called the Albright right now, just off the museum from Buffalo Albright. You feel me? I've been going there my whole life, so I can't really 
I don't know, because you know, we was doing field trips at, you know what I'm saying, six years old, seven years old. I always been in the art. That's what I'm saying. We got into it at nine. Like for real, like doing comic books at nine or ten years old. So yes, we was already ahead of the game. That's what I'm saying. That's why, you know what I mean? You gotta think. I'm I'm like one of the motherfuckers that people be like, cause it's weird. It's like a lot of people never see me, so it's like I'm a mystery. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, Conway do all the shows and tours and do this song and that song. I don't do none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't go on tour. I barely do features. I only rap maybe 14 days out of 365 and give you two albums out of 14 days. You know what I'm saying? So it's not like I I might not rap again in fucking February, March. You know what I'm saying? I don't even have a desire to. You know what I'm saying? So that's the thing. I'm just different. You know what I'm saying? But I always, like I said, as long as you got, you live with morals and principles, you carry your shit the right way. It was bound to happen, you know what I'm saying? But we from Buffalo, so we had to, it was already having to work extra hard. You know what I'm saying? Like, we ain't had no office building, we ain't had nothing. You know what I'm saying? Back when everybody was lit and the dipset days and the geo days and all of that shit, like, that was the days of, you know what I'm saying? Selling crack, carrying guns and shit. Like, motherfuckers was it, you know? We ain't had no, body to pitch our shit to. So it was just like, we was making music that was sitting in the computer because we ain't had nowhere to take it. You know what I'm saying? And we wasn't even like thinking that far yet. We was just on some like, you know, grinding shit. And then I started fucking with, you know, Bama and, you know, moving out there, getting bread and, you know what I'm saying? Just, just, I always, like I said, man, I always was ahead of the game. And I've been grown. You know how when somebody feel like I've been grown my whole life. You know what I'm saying? We didn't grow up. And I can all, I can honestly say, like, you know, a lot of people be faking, but, like, you know, Benny really lived, like, a higher life. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can, I can vouch for that. I was there. I was there when he was born. Benny lived a higher life. Conway lived a higher life. You know what I'm saying? Like, we really lived higher lives. You know what I'm saying? We just went through the motherfucker, like, because that's the thing. You know what I'm saying? We look young, we dress young, but shit, I'm old. You know what I'm saying? I just, I just look young, carry myself young, because why should I, I? I don't need to carry myself old. You know what I mean? But it's like we was in this shit through all the, all the eras. You see what I'm saying? We, we literally went through every era. So I, I can't be, you know, put it like this: like this is young man's sport. You feel me? But the type of shit we making, the dudes that's young, that's even, that's in the ring with us, dropping the same days we dropping all that, they wasn't even born yet. You know what I'm saying? Off the style we use. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, you gotta, you know, I'll try to bridge the gap because I done came from every era. I done learned, I done seen everything. I done seen everything from motherfucking salt and pepper run dmc the motherfucking too short all the way through the nwa days the cool g rap to when Nas came out had the brim the brim scully to yeah. motherfucking you know what i'm saying every era all the woo shit all the fucking you know what i'm saying the death row takeover all the way to when hole took over to like i said the g unit the dipset days when the shit switched to the south to the, i done been through every motherfucking <laughs> layer of hip hop you know what I'm saying so you ever wake up and have one of those days that you just wish there was someone there to talk to or a way to just figure something out that you can't in your life and unfortunately life doesn't come with a user manual like that but there are things to help you out like better help BetterHelp has therapists that are trained to help you figure out your challenging emotions and learn productive coping skills, which makes therapy the closest thing to a guided tour of the complex engine called you. BetterHelp has helped 3 million people with licensed therapists. It's convenient, secure, accessible anywhere, and 100% online. Everyone deserves to feel their best. BetterHelp makes it easier to get started. 
As the world's largest therapy service, they've matched millions of people with professionally licensed and vetted therapists available 100% online. All the benefits of in-person therapy, plus it's more convenient, more accessible, and more affordable. Just fill out a brief questionnaire to match with a therapist. If things aren't clicking, you can easily switch to a new therapist anytime. It couldn't be simpler. No waiting rooms, no traffic, no endless searching for the right therapist. It's there, right for you, right there. So get unstuck with BetterHelp. Learn more and save 10% off your first month at BetterHelp.com slash bucked up. That's BetterHelp, E-H-E-L-P dot com slash bucked up, B-U-C-K-E-D-U-P. Make sure to get the help that you need with better help. Let's get back into it. What would have happened if you blew sooner? If I would have blew sooner? Yeah, you said it was My a- house would be a bigger, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> you think you'd be able to handle it? You think you'd be able to handle it? <laughs> um, yeah. What you mean? That's what I'm saying. Listen, if you come from Eastside Buffalo and you've been in prison, you can handle any motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? You can handle anything. And that's just real shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what I mean. So many people don't even have a story. This shit be make-believe, man. That's why I laugh at you. That's, I'm so comfortable uh, knowing I'm that nigga and can't nobody fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got that mentality. It don't matter how much money you got. It don't matter where you from, what you bang, nothing. I got the mentality still that, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm me, so... You know what I mean? I, I carry that shit well. And, and again, like, you gotta understand, I'm still like, nigga, where my security at? You know where I was carrying. But, but, you know, you know, but, but what I'm trying to tell you is where they at. Right. right. You that nigga, you a real nigga. Where they at? You know, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I came here in what kind of car? Right. Came here in a bad form, my security. Blue, baby. You know what I mean? Still do, I do whatever I want, you know what I'm saying? Still, because it's just like, you know, like I said, I mean, I just, I just, I know that when I always say this shit powered by God, I'm dead ass. You know what I'm saying? Like, third eye shit. You know, it's, 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 it's something I can't even explain. That's why I really don't do interviews and all this and all that, because it's like, you know what I mean? First of all, I don't like giving out too much game, and that's just being real. Yeah, free game, you know? You know what I'm saying? Like, I give you enough already. I, I already school niggas without having to school niggas. You know what I'm saying? I didn't show niggas the way. It's niggas about to be able to take care of their kids for Christmas because of my blueprint that I never even met. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> then why are you doing this? Huh? Why are you doing this? What you doing what? Why are you sitting down with me? Why not? Ain't that what you been asking for? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why'd you say yes? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we, 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 we chilling, we chilling, and you got a good heart. You know what I'm saying? And I didn't see you put a lot of work in and interviewed a lot of people. So it's like, why not? You know what I'm saying? Why not? At the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? But it's just like, I turned down all type of shit, bro. I turned down every tour. I turned down nine features out of every 10. You know what I'm saying? It don't even matter about the money. You know what I'm saying? Because that's the thing. I don't move about money. If I moved about money, my blindtail.com, I have shirts on there every day. You know what I'm saying? I'll be doing chores. I'll be doing this. I'll be doing that. Because I could. I could be 10 times more richer if I just played along with the game. You know what I'm saying? But you don't care about that. I don't care about that. That's the whole point. I'm more, I got everything in my life I already need. What's your proudest moment? Proudest moment? Yeah, not because nigga, I don't got the wrong. <laughs> 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 now, I don't, the proudest moment, man. I don't know, bro, because everything is a blur. I swear, man. I just literally wake up and just do what I do, and, and that's that's what niggas see. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't, I don't even, I don't, I can't even plan longer than three days ahead. You know what I'm saying? I got gun bazoos in what six days. I can't tell you one song I'm doing. I can't tell you nothing because I don't even know yet. You know what I'm saying? I just know I'm gonna do some shit niggas ain't never seen. That's all I know. 
And I guarantee Sunday, Monday, people gonna be like, man, you should have been there, man. This motherfucker had a tall midget. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? Like, this motherfucker came, he motherfucker drove the Lamborghini straight out the plane and just motherfucking oh, landed on South Beach and just started jogging like David Hasselhoff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you never know. That's what I'm saying. But it's just like, you know, the thing about it is, man, I always try to get people their money's worth. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just real shit, you know what I'm saying? I, I do shit even when I don't have to do shit because it's, it's bigger than me, you know what I'm saying? It's way bigger than me. How does that come from selling drugs? Like, you want to make sure that, that film get that. Get yeah, that. yeah, 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 for, for sure, sure. For yeah, sure. Yeah, that's how I be like, right. too. I, 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 I just sure. clean all my films, gang. Yeah. For sure. sure. Like I always say, like, we were just talking about it on the way here in Stowe. It's like, yo, you know what I mean? You know, even though... You know what I'm saying? Like, I consider myself still underground. You feel me? Like, I made a, a tweet about that. Like, I like Griselda like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's like, underground, I'm still underground. So underground, underground motherfuckers, but then, you know what I'm saying? The mainstream, you know what I'm saying? It's like, But the know? people who matter like your shit. Yeah, I mean, shit, if you don't like my shit, something wrong with you. Yeah. I can't even trust you. I can't even look at you. Like, if you listen to my lyrics, there's nothing... There's no, there's no bullshit about it. I walked yeah. into my house and my mom was listening to you. You have to like your music. Oh, God. For real. You know, you know what's crazy? You know what I'm saying? Like, there's, you know, Roman in, in cultures there. It's like the funny shit. Because like I was telling them earlier, I'm going to post that picture. Well, tomorrow, we're going to do the Celtic shit. But Tuesday, I probably post a picture where I got the Celine Furry joints on with the Goyard bag. They made that shit motherfucking. Talib posted that shit last week. They made that shit viral. Told me my shoes you on know, my shoes. Calling me gay now. You know how internet is. Why don't they keep five probably from working in the clubs? Shut up, probably. Shit, fuck that. Why they coming to you? They should be coming here for shit. Funny shit. Shit, funny shit. Funny shit. Like, I, I, it's like yeah, now I just have fun. Now I just have fun. fun. Yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? Now I just really have fun. It's just like, oh, you got the, you know what I'm saying? The Sasquatch sleeves on. Like, people talk about the boots. They ain't never been a fucking pair of fashion week in their life. They don't even know where the fuck they come from. Yeah. How do you have time saying? to they do that? All they know is their neighborhood. They don't even know no fly. Got it, dog. They just got it. They just be, oh, man, they got on a perfect light. Like, come on, man. They got it. You know what I'm saying? This shit is, this shit is. This shit is just hilarious, but like, you know, when we went to go shoot, you know what I mean, that Peppers video, I was in Brooklyn on Flatbush, all my shit on, still, no security, with them furry ass boots on. Who gonna do that? that, Like, I was reading the shit, the comments, and then I'm just thinking to myself, like, first of all, none of y'all motherfuckers in these comments can even come over here. Let alone wear what you call in a person furry shoes. Broad daylight at three o'clock prime time <laughs> on Flatbush with no security, just there. Left that location and went to the other one and met them on Utica. Still the same situation. So everybody was so tough in the hood. Why ain't nobody say shit then? Internet shit ain't real. Internet shit ain't real. Who exactly, has time for exactly. that? Exactly. I just want you to hear that. Because <laughs> right, 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 right. my peppers tasted great, and I have fun with the legends. Because who else could have Black Star come together, do a record, go back to Brooklyn, shoot a video after they just did fucking Saturday Night Live with Dave Chappelle to come fuck with me? When the last time you heard Black Star in Brooklyn? You know what I'm saying? Legendary. So that's what I'm saying. So it's just like, I constantly do shit that ain't nobody ever did. I, I got a song, like I said, I got songs with Doom, DMX, Prodigy, Sean Price, all the fallen legends. Eminem. You know what I'm saying? He ain't no fallen legend. Oh, <laughs> to me. I mean. <laughs> 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 now, nah, shout out to Slim Shady, man. <laughs> Shout out to the cameraman. Shout out Thousand Words. Bow wow. Bow wow. Bow wow. What's the craziest night of my life? Uh huh. Rockington. The craziest night of my life? Yeah. 
I fuck weed bitches. Uh-huh. <laughs> because everything, ain't, every, everything, <laughs> else, everything ain't, everything else ain't so crazy because everything else happened more than once. You know what I mean? I only fuck three bitches one time. Yeah, that, that one time I only did that once. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> you could said statute of limitations on that. Oh, you, know, uh, uh, <laughs> you say allegedly. Hey, babe, that shit was your two. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got the two. Rome, we good? Yeah, yeah, I was yeah. doing an interview till you came. We great. We Shout great. out, Romy just killed it up there yeah, on the first show of his tour. No, we do. Fucking fire department came out. Uh-huh. The fire department, department and West came like out. That That's because West pulled up. Yeah. That's how on fire he is. Yeah, exactly. All that fire. Shout out Kip for the other. Shout out to Kip the Fog. Shout out to Kip for doing this. You know what I mean? Yesterday we said front row Survivor Series. Today we said court side with the Celtics. And let go. You see me on Celtics page right now. They posted me. You know what time it is. Jumbotron shit. You feel me? That's what I'm trying to tell you. What other East Side Buffalo nigga that still rap underground on boom bap shit gets motherfucking rose petals at the Celtics game? You tell me that. That's crazy. Jumbotron shit. You tell me that. You feel me? That's 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 you know that's what the shit is about. That's God. Fly God. Jeez. See me headline next, April twenty eighth, twenty nine. Yo, Sam, let me get some fake This has been fucked up. Peace out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah,